What a galazzo! It was the first in Julian Alvarez's brace in last year's Super Classico between River and Boca, the day the spider became a River Plate star. Now, the 21-year-old Argentinian who won the Copa America with Messi in Brazil and could have signed with Real Madrid at the age of 11 is being sought after by everyone. It's time you got to meet Julian Alvarez. The Spider was born in the year 2000 and got everyone's attention when he scored 60 goals for his local team. That's when a scout put him on a plane for tryouts at Real Madrid at the age of 11. It was my first time on a plane. I arrived and they gave me the number 10 and sent me on the pitch. We won. I scored a bunch of goals. Julian went on to win a youth cup with Madrid, but Real couldn't sign him until his 13th birthday and his family couldn't afford to move to Spain. Barcelona were also interested in him. As Julian's father revealed, Jorge Messi himself called them on FCB's behalf. The family went back to Argentina and this time they gave Julian his wish – to try out at River Plate. Julian's progression under Gachardo was quick. He was still in school when he played and won the Copa Libertadores final against Boca at the Santiago Bernabeu in 2018. But no one imagined the level he'd reach by 2021. To put it into perspective, we should start by looking at the numbers. In 2021, Messi was the Argentinian who scored and assisted the most, with 59 goal participations. Alvarez was second, with 43. He was the fifth under-21 footballer with most goals scored in 2021, behind names such as Erling Haaland and Dusan Valjevic. And only four under-23 players provided more than 15 goals and 15 assists in the world. And there is Alvarez again, alongside Mbappe and Phil Foden. The highest goal scorer in Argentinian football, Alvarez led River Plate to their 36th league title and their first national one under Marcelo Gachardo. And in doing so, he was awarded with the Rey de América Prize by the newspaper El País. The South American award to the best player of the year has been won by Pele, Maradona, Francescoli, Riquelme, and Neymar, just to name a few. So the question is, who are we looking at here? The next Maradona? The next Messi? Maybe Aguero, Iguayan, or Carlos Tevez? Judging by his game, it's none of them. Julian Alvarez is an attacker, but a dynamic one. He's played in every position of the attacking line, including the wings, acting as both an attacking midfielder and as a central number nine. Now he has flourished in a role that sees him as a mix between a false nine that drops to link up play and a Ramdeuter, the role created by Thomas Müller, one in which he floats through the pitch, finding open spaces to attack. Julian is a dribbler. He's a pressing forward, perfect for a Gengen pressing system. He forces his rivals to make costly mistakes. Alvarez is also an assister, grabbing seven goal passes in his title-winning campaign. But above all, 2021 confirmed Julian as a goal threat. He can score every type of goal. Incredible solo efforts, driven shots to the low corner, classic number nine goals living inside the box. Alvarez excels at one-on-one -on -one situations. He's definitely not shy about tapping in rebounds. And the kid's got bazookas on his feet, too. Alvarez has found his killer instinct. His runs grab the attention of defenders and open up spaces for others. He can be selfish as all strikers need to be, but his repertoire in front of the goal is simply impressive. With River Plate, he was decisive in 2021 to clinch the National League title. Three games before the season ended, he scored crucial goals at tough matches and derbies. But above all, he just scored. His final tally was 18 goals and 7 assists in 21 matches played in the league. That's 25 goal participations in 21 matches. And he missed out on three matches as he's a fixed call-up for Scaloni's squad at Argentina's national team. His first call-up was in May and he was included in the squad that won the Copa America in Brazil. An honor for Julian, who revealed Messi is his biggest idol and how he dreamt of playing alongside him. I have no words to describe how well you do everything. The best ever. Alvarez is on his last year of his contract at River Plate, a place he calls home and is in no rush to leave. 
With Qatar 2022 on his mind, staying one more year at Buenos Aires can give him more minutes than what he'd get at a new club. But Inter, Juventus, Atletico de Madrid, Real Madrid, FC Barcelona, Manchester United and City and Bayern Munich, they all want him. And the price tag on Argentina's hottest talent is a mere $23 million, easily payable for most of the clubs mentioned. The only thing that's sure right now is that you're probably one of Julian's newest fans. Where do you think he'll end up? If you like Argentinian wonder kids, chances are you've already heard about Tiago Alma. And in case you haven't, this is the video you're looking for. Meet Tiago Alma. He could be the next Messi. 